So, apparently these shoes right here. Oh God. Sleek box. Oh, indestructible shoes. So indestructible, it means they should not break. So I'm gonna shoot them, catch them on fire, slice them, shoot them, cut them, shoot them again. I don't know, but they're gonna get put through the ringer. So let's go ahead and start destroying these things. Oh, wow. Okay, so first impressions. They're like neoprene up around here. It's like neoprene, so they're nice and flexible. Let's put this other one on. Okay. Not gonna lie, a little bit impressed so far. All right, steel toe works. Um, kind of scuffed them up, gosh darn it. You know, they're pretty comfortable. But I'm gonna get our first test going. I feel like it should pass this one. It says it will. All right, well this is how I see everybody else doing it, so this is how we're gonna do it. I'm putting a decent amount of pressure and it's just it's just folding. I'm just gonna take this shoe and just beat it till it goes through. It's gotta go through. Three, two, one. Oh. Okay, it's in there, but I don't feel anything coming up through the bottom. <sighs> Nothing, bro. Nothing. It's going like an inch in, and that's it. I'm putting all my weight on it, guys. <sighs> it's just bending the nail. It's just bending the nail. I feel like you'd be safe. On to the next uh, test. I can't hear you. Ah, oh, dang it. We got a cutting wheel right here, and I'm gonna put my shoe in this vise. And we're gonna cut my shoe. Let's plug her in. Just gonna go ahead and plug her angle grinder in. Oh, I did it, I did it. The thing is, I'm kind of scared because there's no guard on here, but you know, I've never really had one break on me before, so let's just give her the work. I've been really just kind of giving it to her and let me show you. So obviously the cloth is just going to melt away. You can kind of see there's some, there's some, you know, little spots in there. It's been getting to. I kind of hit her with the a couple times and it really is holding up pretty good. I'm going to see how long it takes before it just it just goes all the way through so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get a timer going and i'm gonna take this and i'm just gonna hold it just nah. all right let's give this thing a cut man start the timer ricky We're through. We're through. I don't know. What was that? 30 seconds maybe? Uh, I mean, it's a pretty safe shoe. If you cannot get a dang grinder off of your foot in 30 seconds, and you deserve to lose your feet. So far, they're doing pretty good. But I think this next one, I think this next one is going to defeat them. You see that right there? This is what I think is going to defeat the shoes. The bolt is sitting on the strings, um, but hopefully it just blows up when I shoot it. So I'm gonna go ahead and shoot the shoe, and I got that, so that'll save my life. Oh, here we go. Safety was on. Three, two, one. Oh, oh no. I just shot, and it's like six inches deep in this solid ass tree. I don't think that's coming out, so I'm just gonna go ahead, get real close, and shoot the shoe. Oh yeah, we hit it that time. Dude, that's a direct shot right through the crone. Oh, that one came out real, oh no. Oh, okay, it did go through there for a second. There for a second, I thought it didn't go through, but it definitely did. We got an entrance right up through the top. We got it out. That nail won't even go in there easily. So this foam stuff is almost like self-healing. So the steel toe can go against cutting wheels, but can it go against a straight up lumberjack? You 
not gonna believe this, guys. You are. <sighs> These shoes are indestructible, and I just destructed them. I just. I just destructed him. I don't know what happened. Ruh, ruh, raggy. We beat the system. I still can't rip it. So, we're close. But we're not, we're not in the shoe yet. Look at that. We broke through him. We did it. I just ripped the steel toe out. So we're starting to break it down. Um, I got a couple more tests though. Indestructible, huh? <clears throat> we got that. Good old isoprobic rubbing alcohol. 91%. I just done set this shoe on fire. Indestructible, huh? Man, ain't that a bummer. Smells like 4th of July. I'm actually pretty impressed um, because if you're ever stranded, that'd be a a freaking amazing fire starter. That may be glue, or is that the sole? Oh, <laughs> everything burnt except for the sole. I mean, it is, it's still solid. And I literally just finished burning. This probably wasn't the intention when they were making the shoe, but if you're ever in a survival situation and you can somehow get that thing lit, get that thing lit because, dude, I crap you not, that thing just burned for 10 minutes, like steady, like just, like steady flame 10 minutes. Locked, cocked, ready to rock. This thing ain't gonna stand a chance. This bolt is going straight through that steel toe. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh. One more try, I'm gonna aim a little bit lower and see what happens. Three, two, one. Oh, that was a direct hit, man. This is just stupid, stupid. You wanna see this? Okay. There's no thing to put on the back of my, on my crossbow. <gasps> Freaking broke it. You wanna see something even better? Okay. I shot at that steel toe on a different little board. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Do you know what this is? You see how hard I'm having to pull on this thing? That right there is the point to my broken bolt, my broken crossbow arrow. Look at the tip of that thing. Look how bent that is. Look at that, it's stupid. You can see where it hit, that little that little edge right there. It's like a pencil. If you're on a piece of paper and you have a pencil, you just, <sighs> dude, it just, it just went bing. <clears throat> Everything exploded. I got this arrow broken. I got that other one in the tree, all because I wanted to shoot a stupid indestructible shoe that turns out to be pretty indestructible. I'm just gonna give you guys a close up of the shoe so that if you do wanna buy one, you can go to the link in my description and help me make enough money, like this video, do all that fancy jazz crap, so I can have enough money to buy my two bolts back. So if you want my straight up opinion, would I recommend this shoe? Okay, yes, I would. You can shoot yourself in the toe with the crossbow and you'll be fine. It, it'll sting a little bit, you can drop cinder blocks on them, you can step on nails, just make sure you don't shoot yourself straight up in the bottom of the foot with the crossbow, only the toe. If you're in a survival situation, you can use it as a fire starter. It's waterproof enough. They really aren't bad. They look decent. They're cool. I need another pair though. Indestructibleshoes.com if you're watching this. Please send me another one because I only have one shoe and a couple broken arrows. Watch this, guys. Didn't even scuff them right there. Didn't even scuff them. If you want to see some more videos like this, I'm going to take those out to the range. 22 shotguns, 308s, 3030s, all sorts of stuff. We'll shoot it, blow it up, tannerite. We got the goods. Thank you guys for watching. Sub, all that crap, you know. Uh, see you guys later on the next video. Oh, my hand, dude. These things are freaking ridiculous. I can't even puncture it. Didn't even puncture it. Kobe.